Taurus and welcome back to my channel Aquarian Empress Tarot. For those of you who are new to the channel Taurus, please do me a huge favor. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below along with that notification bell. That way you can be notified anytime I go live or post new content. So Taurus, let's get right into it. First off, we're going to start with some Oracle messages, of course, as always. And then we're going to go right into general finances, career, and love, all right? So, Taurus, do me a huge favor if you would please and thank you guys so very much because I appreciate all of your support, love, likes, comment, share, subscribes, all right? Make sure you leave a comment. If the reading resonates for you, please leave a comment down in the comment section below, okay? So, let's see. What's the T for Taurus? All right, Holy Spirit, what messages do you have for Taurus? Completion, woo, Taurus, we have completion here. So some of y'all are working on achieving goals, Taurus. This is awesome. Um, we have completion or some of you have, you have completed something. You have um, reached a goal. Maybe you finished a course. Maybe you just purchased a new home. Maybe you've gotten your credit score to where you want it to be. This is awesome energy, Taurus. Look at that face. We have completion. We have final attainment, victory, a crescendo, job well done, perfection, peak performance, and prudence. So some of y'all are really in beast mode, Taurus. Like y'all are really hauling ass this, this year to get to where you want to be. All right, I see you. We see you, Taurus. <laughs> you ain't let nothing stand in your way. As I look at this card, it reminds me of, um, you know, the famous runner, Jackie Joyner Cursor. I think that was her name. Um, one of the first black women to run, you know, as an athlete. That's what it reminds me of. And she never let anything get in her way. That's what that reminds me of. We also have peace. We have harmony, balance, perfection, equipoise, a sense of well-being, favorable, favorable conditions, expansion. So, Taurus, a lot of you guys are really focused on inner peace and balance in your life. And that is a beautiful energy. Um, if there's anything that may be holding you back or anyone that may be holding you back, goodbye. Goodbye. Deuces, right? Go ahead and cut them off, make them feel it, Taurus. <sighs> Give me one more heart spirit. Yeah, deliverance. It's time, it's time to let go of this type of turmoil. Out here stuck in the middle of the desert in the middle of a thunderstorm. No ma'am. No, sir. We have release, relief, a fresh approach, liberation from obstruction, finding a solution and exhilaration. So being um, exhilarated from a situation, a tumultuous situation, a difficult trying, testing type of period. Maybe some of y'all have been going through it, Taurus. My prayers out to you. Definitely sending you guys lots of love, healing and abundance your way. But Spirit saying you are going to get to the point of where you are at peace. You have attained a victory, personal victories as well, but even big victories as well. You know, so blessings are coming in for you, Taurus. All right. So what messages do you have for Spirit for Taurus in regards to finances? And then we'll go into love. Let's see. breakthrough finally i love it taurus what did i tell you, you guys look y'all got the victory let me tell y'all listen y'all are the goat okay y'all are the goat y'all are the goats law of attraction and manifesting so a lot of you guys have really been manifesting what it is that you really want in your life you have really been on it taurus 
perfect time to invest. Some of you are making investments in the stock market, Acorn, Stash, Robin. But Spirit said, uh, 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 Taurus, don't go broke trying to show off and show out. Look, and we have guided by spirit. So you are on the right track, Taurus. You are on the right track. I love it. I love it. You know what? I ain't even got to read for y'all no more, Taurus. <laughs> y'all, you know what? Y'all's reading is already off the chain. Beautiful reading. Lots of positive energy. I'm loving it. Okay. I need Taurus to like be in my chart or something. Because y'all like what y'all got going on is just whoo. All right. Let's get some love messages for you guys, Taurus, and see what's up there. All right, Holy Spirit, what's the message for Taurus? What's their current love situation? Current love situation for Taurus. We have, well, Divine Feminine. It could be Divine Masculine as well. So please take what messages resonate and leave the rest. We have hamster wheel. <laughs> so a lot of y'all, especially y'all divine feminines, y'all are really um, focusing on your day-to-day -day life, your nine to five, your money. Like I said, getting your credit score together, building your brand, starting your businesses. Like Tauruses, y'all are on y'all's ish. We have financial support and we have divine masculine. Some of you may be getting child support or filing for child support from a divine masculine or possibly alimony or, or possibly finalizing a divorce from a divine masculine especially if you're a feminine watching this video some of y'all may be um filing for a divorce or uh child support we have pretending we have pretending because this person they pretended to be something that they weren't fake living beyond means things didn't work out between the two of you things didn't work out between the two of you taurus So you may have to have a conversation with this person, especially if this is the father of your child, because I had talk, conversation, um, get on the same page. You may have to, you know, come to some type of mutual agreement with this person. We have recalling, reminiscing memories or returning. Listen, y'all got the same damn energy as Aries. Somebody from the past wants y'all back, Taurus. This is not for everybody. Like I said, take what messages resonate leave the rest but you got away you're the one that got away escapade <laughs> and i love this she's beautiful this is a geisha okay and um she's very geishas are very high maintenance in china i mean these women are absolutely like the standard of beauty and high maintenance you know bad and bougie type energy which i which when i think about that i think about you guys taurus because i feel like you guys just don't settle but anywho, you're the one that got away. And I feel like this is what makes them now want to come after you. But you're like, just give me my money and go. Just give me my money and go. Like we have we have a kid that's enough. For those of you who have a child with this person, it's like you just want them to do their part and just go. Like they want to come back. Of course they do. Yeah, interview. They want to talk. They want to see how you two can compromise, get on the same page. Taurus, I don't think y'all are having it. Only y'all having it. Let's see. Yeah, trash. Because this is trash to you. We have negotiator. Yeah, this person wants to try to come back in and um, beg and, and bar bargain with you to try to see if y'all can come back together. Look, we've got come together. Any day now. Reconciliation, spiritual union, soul contract. We have today. We have today. Present now in the moment. So any day now, at any time, any time this month, this person may be coming to But you're happy without them. You are happy without them. We have happiness. We have lockbox. Because when you were together, it was like you two, you felt trapped by this person, Taurus. And this person had you up and down. We got roller coaster, highest high, adrenaline rush. And we have waves, emotional. Also, this person is the type of person that wouldn't take responsibility for their actions. We have denial. Very, very irresponsible and very, very prideful. This person would not admit when they were wrong. And look, we have history so you two definitely have history together this person caused you a lot of anxiety because there were a lot of things that came to light about this person with you you found out some things some of y'all this person may have had you in a third party situation some of you this person may have lied about some things we have unconditional love you tried to give this person genuine love taurus and it just it just was out of control 
So, yeah, there was toxicity here. We got poison. So, yeah, they want to come back and try to make it right. But you, <laughs> you're the one that got away, Taurus, okay? Now I'm going to ask, what's the possible outcome here? Spirit, what's the possible outcome with this whole situation, this love situation for Taurus? What's the possible outcome here, Holy Spirit? So I'm gonna come, yeah, you're going to have options. You're going to be faced with some options, some choices, Taurus. They want to bring you an apology, too. I saw the five of cups, five of swords. Yeah. because You've given up on this situation. You've given up on this situation. What's the possible outcome here? The high priest is because you know. There's things that you know. You're not saying it, but you know. And you're focused on your own healing and your own growth. And moving forward with the two of wands. You're moving in a new direction without them. Okay. You moving on, Taurus. I heard it. I heard that. Taurus is moving on. Right? Moving on. Keeping strong. Don't you let them say you're wrong. It's a group thing. Let's see. All right, so Taurus, that has been your general collective reading for the month of March. Please leave a comment down in the comment section below. And if you enjoy the reading, please like, share, subscribe. And until next time, love you guys.